In the heart of the Taiga village, where the bitter chill of the arctic wind swept through the towering pines, a young boy's longing for a furry companion echoed in the frosty air. Life in this remote settlement was a tapestry woven with threads of resilience and unity, where every member of the community played a vital role in its survival. The boy's parents, sturdy pillars of strength amid the icy wilderness, epitomized the spirit of perseverance. His father, a seasoned hunter, braved the treacherous forests in search of game to sustain their small community, while his mother tended to the hearth and home with unwavering dedication, together, they forged a bond as enduring as the frozen landscape that surrounded them, their love for their son serving as a beacon of warmth in the coldest of winters. Despite the harsh realities of life in the taiga, the boy's yearning for a furry friend remained unabated, with each passing day, he would gaze wistfully at the dogs that roamed the village streets, their loyal companionship a stark contrast to his own solitary existence, yet, his parents, mindful of the challenges that came with caring for a pet in such unforgiving conditions, hesitated to grant his fervent wish, then, on a crisp winter's day tinged with the promise of snow, the boy's world was forever changed by an unexpected visit from his uncle and his family. Arriving from a neighboring settlement, they brought with them a sense of warmth and joy that thawed the icy. Barriers of the boy's heart, as they stepped out of their sled, cheeks flushed with the cold, the boy's uncle produced a small, nondescript box from beneath his coat, a mischievous twinkle in his eye. With eager anticipation, the boy watched as his uncle carefully lifted the lid, revealing a flurry of movement within. Nestled within the confines of the box was a tiny, gray puppy, its bright eyes sparkling with curiosity and affection. Overwhelmed with emotion, the boy reached out to cradle the precious gift in his trembling hands, his heart overflowing with gratitude in that fleeting moment, as snowflakes danced upon the frozen landscape and laughter filled the air, the boy's dream of companionship was realized in the most unexpected of ways, despite the initial reservations of his parents, the bond between boy and dog flourished, a testament to the enduring power of love amidst the harshest of conditions, and so, amidst the towering pines of the Taiga village, a boy and his faithful, Companion embarked on a journey of shared adventures, their spirits intertwined like the roots of the ancient trees that watched over them, with each passing day, their bond grew stronger, a testament to the unbreakable bonds of friendship forged in the crucible of the arctic wilderness. With a sense of responsibility befitting a dedicated owner, the boy embraced his newfound role with boundless enthusiasm. His days were filled with the joyful antics of his furry companion, whom he lovingly cared for with unwavering devotion. From playful romps in the snow to tender moments of affection, the bond between boy and dog flourished under the boy's attentive care, yet, amidst their carefree adventures, a sudden howl shattered the tranquility of their play, instinctively, the boy scooped up his beloved dog, his heart pounding with fear as the eerie sound echoed from the nearby woods, rushing home to seek refuge with his father. The boy's mind raced with apprehension at the thought of. Lurking dangers in the wilderness, faced with the unsettling prospect of a nearby wolf pack, the boy's father prepared to take action, his resolve steeled by the need to protect their village from potential threats, but as he reached for his weapon, the boy intervened, his voice trembling with compassion, he couldn't bear the thought of harm befalling the wild creature, whose presence seemed more curious than menacing to the boy's astonishment. The wolf had trailed them home, its demeanor. Surprisingly docile as it lounged on their porch, its golden eyes gleaming with an unexpected gentleness, against all odds, the wild predator had become an unlikely companion, its intimidating exterior belied by a playful spirit that mirrored the boy's own boundless energy. In the days that followed, the wolf's presence became a familiar sight in the boy's household, its imposing stature softened by a newfound sense of belonging. Even the boy's parents, initially wary of the untamed intruder, found themselves won over by the creature's quiet charm however acceptance from the village proved to be a far greater challenge when the family was invited to a birthday celebration the sight of the wolf elicited fear and suspicion among the guests prompting the boy's mother to confine the animal to the safety of the barn undeterred by the judgment of others the boy sat outside the barn his voice a soothing presence amid the wolf's restless pacing yet as the festivities drew to a close a sudden realization dawned upon the gathering, a realization that sent shivers of dread down their spines, the boy was missing, in the frantic moments that followed, fear gripped the hearts of all who knew him, 
with the forest looming ominously in the distance, the villagers rallied together in a desperate search for the boy, their voices calling out into the darkness with a sense of urgency born of unyielding dread as the night wore on. The village settled into an uneasy silence, each member. Consumed by worry for the missing boy, despite the gnawing ache of uncertainty, the decision was made to postpone the search until the first light of dawn, a somber acknowledgement of the dangers lurking in the darkness, with heavy hearts, the villagers retreated to their homes, clinging to the fragile hope that awaited with the breaking of dawn, yet, amidst the quiet desperation, a flicker of realization ignited within the boy's mother. A realization that would set into motion a chain of events. None could have foreseen rushing to the barn where the wolf had been confined, the boy's mother threw open the gate, unleashing the creature into the night with a sense of urgency that bordered on desperation, with a single-minded determination that belied its wild nature, the wolf darted into the forest, its primal instincts guiding its path with unerring precision, unable to ignore the silent plea in the wolf's eyes. The boy's mother followed in its wake, her footsteps echoing softly against the forest floor as she struggled to keep pace, each step brought her closer to the truth, her heart pounding with a mixture of dread and anticipation, in the dim light of dawn, amidst the tangled undergrowth of the forest, the wolf's keen senses led it unerringly to the boy's side, there, amidst the shadows, lay the unconscious form of the boy, his leg ensnared in the cruel jaws of a trap. A grim reminder of the dangers that lurked within the wilderness, with tender care, the wolf stood watch. Over the boy, its silent vigil a testament to the bond that had formed between them, as the first rays of sunlight filtered through the trees, the boy's parents arrived on the scene, their relief mingled with disbelief at the sight before them, for in that moment, as the boy stirred from his slumber, the true depth of the wolf's loyalty became apparent, with teeth marks marring his tattered clothes, the boy recounted his harrowing ordeal, the pain of his injuries, the terror of being lost in the forest, and the unwavering presence of his unlikely savior, as the boy was rushed to the hospital for treatment, his parents were left to grapple with the realization of their own prejudice, in the face of adversity, the wolf had proven itself not as a fearsome predator, but as a steadfast companion, a guardian angel in fur and fawn, with gratitude in their hearts, the family welcomed the wolf into their home, embracing it as an integral part of their lives, and as the boy recovered from his Injuries, a newfound sense of understanding blossomed between them. Forged in a crucible of shared hardship and unwavering loyalty, in the end, it was a tale of redemption, a testament to the power of compassion and the enduring bond between man and beast, and as the village rallied around their newfound friend, the echoes of their shared journey reverberated through the forest, a reminder that even in the darkest of times, hope could be found in the unlikeliest of places. We eager to hear from you so be sure to leave your thoughts and opinions in the comments. Section down below, after watching this story, what do you think of, then there is an another story about a wolf and her cubs, let's expect what will happen, in the midst of the hospital's bustling corridors, a sudden commotion shattered the usual calm, sending ripples of confusion and fear through the staff, Ella, a seasoned nurse accustomed to handling crises with a steady hand felt her pulse quicken as the muffled sounds of distress echoed through the halls, with a sense of duty tinged with curiosity, she hastened toward the source of the disturbance, her mind racing with possibilities, however, her path was soon blocked by an orderly, his expression grave with concern, something was amiss, a sense of unease permeating the air like an ominous cloud, as rumors spread like wildfire, whispers of a wild intruder running amok within the hospital's confines sent a shiver down Ella's spine. With a mixture of apprehension and determination, Ella pressed forward, her resolve unshaken by the chaos unfolding around her, drawing upon her experience in crisis management, she steeled herself for whatever lay ahead, her instincts guiding her toward the heart of the unfolding drama when she approached the scene, a sight greeted her that defied belief, a lone wolf, its majestic form weaving through the corridors with an air of purpose, yet, amidst the chaos, Ella's trained eye caught sight of something unexpected, a mark upon the wolf's nose that stirred a flicker of recognition within her. In that moment of clarity, the pieces of a puzzle long forgotten fell into place, revealing a connection that transcended the boundaries of human and beast, for this was no ordinary encounter it was a reunion forged in the crucible of a shared past in the aftermath of a devastating forest fire that had ravaged the land, Ella had volunteered her skills to aid the injured wildlife, 
Amidst the charred remains of the once vibrant forest, she had tended to the wounded with a tenderness born of empathy, each bandage a testament to her unwavering dedication, it was amidst this chaos that she had encountered a lone wolf pup, her tiny form battered and bruised by the flames, with a heart overflowing with compassion, Ella had nursed the young wolf back to health, forging a bond that defied logic and reason and now, as fate would have it, their paths had crossed once more. A serendipitous reunion that served as a reminder of the enduring power of compassion and connection as the chaos of the moment subsided and animal control arrived to safely contain the wolf, Ella's heart swelled with a sense of gratitude, for in the face of adversity, it was the bond between human and animal that had emerged as the true beacon of hope, a testament to the resilience of the human spirit and the enduring legacy of compassion in even the most unexpected of places. When Ella's hands worked tirelessly to tend to the wounded hedgehog, her mind raced with a mixture of anticipation and trepidation, each call. For her emergency assistance carried with it the weight of uncertainty, a reminder of the fragile balance between life and death in the wake of the forest fire's devastation but it was the sight of a tiny wolf pup, nestled beneath a tangle of rocks and debris, that brought Ella's world to a standstill, the pup's eyes, wide with fear and pain, mirrored the turmoil raging within Ella's own heart as she reached out to cradle the trembling creature in her arms, with a tenderness born of experience, Ella. Set to work, her hands moving with practiced precision as she tended to the pup's injuries, bloodied and battered, the pup clung to her with a desperate trust, seeking solace in the warmth of human compassion amidst the chaos of the world outside. As the days passed, Ella and her friend Mike devoted themselves to the pup's care, their tireless efforts a testament to the resilience of the human spirit in the face of adversity, together. They watched as the pup grew stronger, his once fearful eyes now filled with a glimmer of hope for the future but it was the unexpected appearance of Lupe, the wolf who had once been a helpless pup in need of Ella's care, that reignited a spark of recognition within Ella's heart, despite the passage of time, the bond forged between human and beast remained as strong as ever, a silent testament to the enduring power of love and compassion, yet, amidst the joy of their reunion, a shadow of concern lingered in Ella's mind, for as she looked into Lupe's eyes, she, saw a reflection of her own fear and uncertainty, a silent plea for help that transcended the barriers of language and understanding and then, in a moment of heart-wrenching clarity, Lupe dropped a tiny bundle into Ella's outstretched hand, a fragile reminder of the cycle of life and the unbreakable bond between mother and child while Ella examined the injured pup, her heart heavy with the weight of responsibility. She couldn't help but wonder at Lupe's sudden departure, what had driven the mother. Wolf to leave her precious pup behind, alone and vulnerable in a world fraught with danger, with tears glistening in her eyes, Ella cradled the injured pup close to her chest, her mind racing with questions and doubts, but amidst the uncertainty, one thing remained clear, the bond forged between human and wolf, a testament to the enduring power of love in the face of adversity, and as Ella watched the sliding door close behind Lupe, she knew that their journey was far from over, a journey of Compassion, courage, and the unbreakable bond between mother and child, spanning the vast expanse of wilderness and beyond as Ella tended to the injured pup, her thoughts remained consumed by the enigmatic disappearance of Lupe, the mother wolf, though the urgency of the situation demanded her immediate attention, a sense of unease gnawed at the edges of her consciousness. An unspoken fear that whispered of a greater peril lurking in the shadows with animal control en route to retrieve the injured pup, Ella relinquished her care into the capable hands of the accompanying veterinarian, her mind already racing ahead to the task that lay before her, as her shift drew to a close, she made a decision, one born of instinct and determination, to seek out Lupe and uncover the truth behind her sudden departure, with a resolute stride, Ella ventured into the forest, her steps guided by a sense of purpose that eclipsed the weariness weighing upon her shoulders, beside her, the dense canopy of Trees stretched skyward, their whispering leaves a symphony of secrets waiting to be unraveled but as the hours wore on and fatigue began to set in, doubt crept into Ella's mind, casting a shadow over her resolve, yet, just as she contemplated turning back, a distant sound echoed through the stillness, a mournful howl that sent a shiver down her spine drawing upon her courage, Ella pressed forward, her senses attuned to the subtle rhythms of the forest, and then, amidst the tangled undergrowth. She caught sight of a familiar figure, a lone wolf, 
her golden eyes filled with a silent plea for help, with cautious steps, Ella approached, her heart pounding with a mixture of apprehension and hope, for nestled beside the wolf lay a small well, its yawning mouth a silent testament to the danger lurking within, and then, in a moment of heart-stopping clarity, Ella discovered the source of Lupe's anguish, two tiny pups, their fragile forms trapped within the depths of the well, with a sinking heart. Ella realized the enormity of the task that lay before her, a race against time to rescue the helpless creatures from certain peril. But as she pondered her next move, a familiar voice broke through the silence, a voice belonging to Mike, her friend and ally in the fight to save Lupe's pups, with a surge of relief, Ella watched as Mike approached, his steady presence a beacon of hope amidst the chaos of the forest, together, Ella and Mike set to work, their minds racing with the urgency of the moment, with makeshift tools and unyielding determination. They devised a plan to reach the stranded pups, their hands working in harmony. As they sought to overcome the obstacles that stood in their way and as they lowered themselves into the depths of the well, guided by the flickering light of determination burning within their hearts, Ella knew that they were bound by a common purpose, a purpose that transcended the boundaries of species and spoke to the unbreakable bond between human and beast for in that moment, amidst the tangled undergrowth of the forest, Ella realized that their journey was far from over, a journey of compassion, courage, and the enduring power of hope in the face of adversity, and as they worked tirelessly to rescue the trapped pups, the echoes of their shared determination reverberated through the forest, a testament to the resilience of the human spirit and the unbreakable bond between guardian and guardian as the tension reached its peak, Lupe's reaction to Mike's sudden appearance was swift and fierce. A primal instinct born of fear and uncertainty, with a menacing snarl, she charged. Towards him, her protective instincts overriding any semblance of reason or restraint, Ella watched in horror as the scene unfolded before her eyes, her heart pounding with a mixture of fear and helplessness, despite her desperate calls for Lupe to stop, the wolf pressed on, her gaze fixed upon Mike with an intensity that bordered on ferocity but then, in a moment of breathtaking clarity, Lupe paused, her nostrils twitching as she caught the familiar scent of her longtime caretaker, with a tentative sniff, she seemed to recognize Mike's scent, a flicker of recognition softening the steely resolve in her eyes, and just like that, the tension dissipated, replaced by a palpable sense of relief as Lupe turned away from Mike, her focus returning to the task at hand, rescuing her stranded pups from the depths of the well. With Mike's expertise as a wildlife rescuer, the duo quickly sprang into action, harnessing their combined skills to orchestrate a daring rescue mission, with a sturdy, Rope secured to a nearby tree, Mike descended into the darkness below, his movements methodical and precise as he retrieved each injured pup from the depths of the well when the pups were reunited with their anxious mother, a wave of emotion washed over Ella, her eyes brimming with tears at the sight of their heartwarming reunion, for in that moment, amidst the chaos and uncertainty, she witnessed the unbreakable bond between mother and child, a bond that transcended pain and adversity, uniting them in a shared journey of love and resilience with the pup safely secured in the back of Mike's vehicle, the trio made their way to the sanctuary, where a team of veterinarians stood ready to provide the care and attention they so desperately needed, as the pups were examined and treated for their injuries, Ella's gaze drifted to Lupe, who stood watchful and vigilant by their side, her unwavering determination a testament to the strength of a mother's love, but then, as they celebrated the successful rescue of the pups, Tragedy struck once more, a horrifying revelation that threatened to shatter the fragile peace they had fought so hard to restore, for nestled within Lupe's belly lay a jagged shard of steel, a grim reminder of the dangers lurking within the depths of the well, with a sinking heart, Ella realized the extent of Lupe's injuries. A silent testament to the sacrifices she had made in her desperate bid to save her precious pups and yet, even in the face of unimaginable pain. Lupe remained steadfast in her devotion to her family, a beacon of courage and resilience amidst the darkness that threatened to engulf them all, and as Ella watched, tears streaming down her cheeks, she knew that their journey was far from over, a journey of healing, of hope, and of the unbreakable bond between a mother and her pups, forged in the crucible of love and sacrifice Lupe's ordeal had taken a toll on her fragile frame, and as she collapsed, the urgency of her situation became all too. A parent, rushed into the operating room, 
the medical team worked tirelessly to remove the shard of steel lodged within her abdomen, a silent testament to the perilous journey she had undertaken. With each passing moment, Lupe's life hung in the balance, her weakened state a stark reminder of the fragility of existence, yet, against all odds, she had endured. Her resilience a beacon of hope amidst the darkness that threatened to consume her as the medical team stemmed the tide of blood loss, a collective sigh of relief swept through the room, tempered by the sobering reality of Lupe's long road to recovery, in the days that followed, Mike and Ella took on the task of caring for her precious pups, their days filled with the gentle rhythm of bottle feedings and tender caresses, with Lupe confined to an enclosure adjacent to her pups, they found solace in each other's presence. A silent reassurance that they were not alone in their struggle, and as the weeks turned into months, a miraculous transformation took place, as Lupe and her pups grew stronger with each passing day, their once fragile forms infused with a newfound vitality and strength and so, with hearts full of hope and anticipation, Mike and Ella stood witness to the momentous occasion, the long-awaited release of Lupe and her brood back into the wild, as they watched the majestic creatures disappear into the embrace of the forest. A sense of profound gratitude washed over them, a reminder of the enduring power of compassion, courage, and the unbreakable bond between human and beast and as they savored the quiet moments of reflection that followed, Mike and Ella made a silent vow to stay connected, their shared experience forging a bond that transcended the boundaries of friendship and time, for in the end, it was not just Lupe and her pups who found salvation amidst the chaos. It was also the enduring friendship between two unlikely allies, united by a common purpose and a shared journey of love and resilience.